Learn how to make a password digital safe, using only logic gates. Hello guys. Today I will show you how to make a 9-digit password safe, on Logisim. As a conventional safe, this project will work using a 0 to 9-digit pad, and when the all 4 digits was correctly inserted, the safe will be opened. To reach our objective, let me show this working diagram of operation. We start with the input, the 9-digit pad and the decimal do binary converter, if you remember from my previous video, I showed you how to make the decimal to binary converter, now we will put this into practice. So, after typing each digit, the covert binary value will be stored in a memory, to be checked to the stored password memory, this will be done with a 4-digit password comparator. If, all 4 digits of the input was matched with the password memory, the safe will be opened. Now, let's see how to make the 4-digit memory. So, after we converted the digit to binary signal, all bits B0, B1, B2, and B3, goes to 4 flip-flops. Also note that, I use the same 4-bit signal as the clock for the flip-flops. This way, every digit typed is automatically stored in memory. Now, let's make an example, let's store the digits, 1, 2, 4, and 8. See that, I need to start with the inverted digit, starting with 8, until digit 1, this is necessary because each line of flip-flops, will transfer to the next line on next clock, so inverted the digit, will store in the correct order. Now, let's go to the password memory. As you can see, it is the same circuit of the input memory, but it has one more bit control to set up the password digits. This is connected to the enable input, of all flip-flops, and this circuit will only work, when we want to change the password, of our safe. The next step is to compare every digit of memory input, to the memory password. See now the circuit that do this. I use XOR gate to compare each bit, of a single digit. The XOR is good for this purpose because, the result of the operator is zero, if both bits are the same, no matter if the bits are zero or one. So, each set of four XOR gates, will compare two digits, one from input memory, and another from password memory. Also note that, to joint all results of two digits, I use a NOR gate, so if everything is zero, and the two digit are the same. Now, to finish the comparator, I just use a ANDY gate, to all results of four digits comparator. So is everything is okay, the safe will be open. Let's make an example. First, I will set up the password to 7, 5, 2, and 9. Now, typing 4 times the digit 0 will reset the input memory. Typing again our password, the safe will be open. Also note that, no other numerical sequence will open the safe. Let's see, the comparator working. Look that, when all bit matched, the result is 0, and then inverted to 1 with NOR gate. We finished, demonstrating all components, of the password protected safe, using only logic gates. I hope you enjoyed this video. This circuit will be available, in my GitHub repository. Please don't forget to like and subscribe, soon more projects will be made for you. Goodbye.